Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting for you to episode 15 of season 2 of Java's Reincarnations. Let it get started in 3, 2, 1, go. I'm thirsty. Damn. Well, my soda's still over there, but damn. Oh. Maybe it's from Paul. See? Like, oh my god, you got married? There you go, that's a good dad. That's pretty. <gasps> Poor Roxy. Thank God it's him and Yeah, that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. Hmm. 
Maybe. You want to talk about that now? Go kill myself now, okay, guys? Cause I fucking can't. Oh! Right? I mean, I would be hella worried about that. Well, okay, that was not good. Let's not do that again, okay? to the drawing board huh? Thank you. It's complicated.
right. I mean, because she's highly upset. I feel for her. Because in the end, she just wants to go home. And the fact that she can't, it's just, it's breaking her heart. That's good. Probably not. She had to literally put like all of her stuff into studying and to try to go home. Okay. I mean, in that moment, did they both think that she was self-harming herself? Can we not think about that? Maybe she was using it for protection. It's like if as of this she's too far gone. All you can really do is just be there for her. Oh my god. Is it cuz my freaking brain? Oh. <laughs> 
Well, yeah, what do you think? Can we just talk about how much the light went back into her eyes when she saw that? Oh, uh, it's beautiful. a couple. a bottle. <laughs> no, it's a plastic water bottle. <laughs> it, it's, uh, that is still a freaking success. <laughs> you gonna say thank you as well? <laughs> That's just what happens when you get drunk. You either <laughs> you're sleepy, you're horny, you're angry, you're sad, whatever. Oh, 
Okay, I'm glad that we went through, like, honestly, two different phases of depression. In a way, just the the whole issue of it, one, and then especially just the resolution of it being like, oh my god. But yeah, literally having the light coming back into her eyes and be like, oh my god, why the F didn't I think about this? Like, that touches my soul. And it freaking worked! Girl, girl got an egg plastic bottle! To <laughs> I'm never looking at plastic bottles the same way again because, bam, plastic bottles can officially be isekai. That, that's the one thing I never thought. Well, you know, with the vending machine show, we all know that anything can be isekai. And <laughs> but no, oh my God. No, that was just really sweet. I'm happy for her because it's one step closer to her going home because that's all she really just wants at the end of the day. She, as much as she loves being there and being in a different world and new with new environments and people and everything, I think the feeling of missing home will never go away. Even if you go to like a different part of the state or a, a different country or in the world, you still go fuck up as home. Like you gonna be happy, like yeah, you on vacation, but no, nah, you ready to go home. Like, <laughs> I fucking thought we would never see him again. But uh, see, season two is just promising with all this shit. And I fucking love it. Oh my god. Because dead ass. I'm thinking like, nah, he's gonna go just as much as like it is. Even though one day we are going to see her again. And that, it's good. Okay, for me, I'm gonna be happy. But then at the same time, I'm gonna be sad when we see her again eventually. Because of the fact is the same way Rudy was feeling, I was feeling the same way as so I, I and as well. I think a lot of people are very much when it is especially, you know, makes her fucking appearance back in this show, um, are definitely going to be mixed because you like okay. I, I would say this. I, I can't say all guys, but I can say majority of some girls who have watched the show and who have once again we've talked about this, had the issue of the finally giving your all to that person and I can say guys can possibly are like this as well because I've seen it happen before and you give them the one thing that the opposite person truly wants and then the next day they're just gone in a flash without like no remorse or just like oh hey or rest of certain, you know mm, because with Rudy and Sylvie he almost felt that feeling way again and, and then you know Sylvie's like no no I ain't going anywhere like no <laughs> like I'm not gonna uh, hit it and you know get my itch and just go no no I'm not a bitch like what do you think what the fuck do you think I am so that is going to still be a very interesting con a conversation and pivotal moment for this show to see because it's gonna define like their relationship even though like something tells me he's still gonna want to be with her duh because something tells me we might go the sister wives route with this show yes I I'm, I'm like I'm a little 100% sure because dad's already done it technically so if the son does it, what the fuck? I, I mean, you know, I can't be mad about it. It's a show. If the show does it, it does it. If it doesn't, it doesn't. I don't really give a fuck at the end of the day. But something tells me we're going that route. He's going to have multiple wives. So it is what it is. But no, like seriously, at the end of the day, for Miss Silent, once again, that is another step for her possibly going home. And let's say this show overall, whenever we do get to the final season, it concludes with her going home. I would really love that for her. I think she really deserves that. Through everything that she's done as of the time of, since we met her, 
she deserves it. And I hope that, you know, one day it does come to fruition and that she is able to see her friends and her family again. Because that's all she wants at the end of the day. She doesn't want to be here. She just wants to go home. There's nothing wrong with that. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 15 of season 2 of Jobless Reincarnation. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Matchup Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Sunday for episode 16. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.